We got Kamal Vey, who just wrapped up his Junior World Championships, finishing fifth in the world. Kamal, you wrestled Mahmoudov, who you saw last year in the finals, for bronze. Talk about that match. Uh, it was just another match, you know, got a toss over his shoulder, get ready for the Senior World. You know, everybody here was preparing for me, training for me, and you know, that's what you want. Uh, honestly, this just uh, gave me a view of what to expect at the Senior Worlds because no doubt in my mind, everybody's going to be watching this. So from, now, from here on, you know, just got to prepare a little differently, you know, come out with a little something different because, uh, you know, they're studying me, you know, they're getting ready for me because I'm a threat. Coming into this tournament, was that a match that you were looking forward to or hoping would happen considering last year's explosive finals? Uh, I mean, I could kill that. It was, it was one of those things where, you know, he's bumping up 72 kilos, 77, to, uh, to wrestle me. And he's going back down to 72, so I don't feel like that's something, like, to look forward to in the future if he's going to keep going up and down, you know. For me, like, if you want to compete with me, you got to stay at the same way. We have to meet up at every tournament. You know, you push me, I push you, and we both get better and achieve our goals that way. But um, uh, it, was a, it was a good run. I had a fun time here at uh, Slovakia. It was uh, great to see my guys. Shout out to Andy. Uh, made it to the finals. I'm so proud of him, man. You know, he's come a long way. And uh, now we got to get ready for Cody Schultz. He's about to come up, and uh, hopefully he gets the bronze medal for uh, USA. Right. You mentioned that this is a way to get ready for Worlds for, for Budapest. Uh, what are some things that you're taking going into that tournament next month? Uh, you know, just uh, got to keep my my mind uh, creative, you know, when people try to slow me down, figuring out ways and positions uh, to get out of it, uh, finding places to uh, catch my breath, uh, working on my lift process, uh, getting the guys up so I, I don't get reversed on my lifts, and that's pretty much it for me. Do you find this was like a good tune-up tournament for something like that, knowing that the, the level's even greater than uh, the I'd say this was, a, this was a great tune-up, you know, there's a lot of adversity here. Uh, the food uh, was all right, <laughs> but, uh, you know, this, situations like that can only make you tougher. Uh, I'm not looking. Uh, I'm not looking down on myself or anything. Like I said, like a lot doesn't define me. It's just uh, how I bounce back from it. So, what's the first thing you're gonna do when you get home? Uh, eat a real meal. Uh, the second thing I'm gonna do is, uh, you know, take a little time off. You know, recover, rest up my body and stuff. And then uh, I don't know, probably uh, see my family and stuff. You know, they miss me. So, those are a couple things I'm looking forward to when I get back. You mentioned we have a finalist tomorrow, Andrew Berryessa. You've been in that spot before. Mm -hmm. What is some advice you would give him? Uh, all I got to say is uh, go take it, man. You know, it's your match to win. It's the last match of the day. You know, it's too late to be nervous. You got on your plane. You can't be nervous anymore. You just all focus, all strength, and, you know, just be proud of where you are. And, you know, you, you earned it. Being in the, uh, the opening ceremony for the finals is one of the best experiences I'll have in my junior career. Uh, sad to say I didn't get the medal this time, but uh, I had a lot of great memories, a lot of great matches, and gave the fans something to, to enjoy while being here. Last question, Kamal. Last year, after the gold medal match, you showed a great amount of sportsmanship with him, mm -hmm. picking him up and taking a photo with him. He did the same thing with you this year. What does that mean in a sport like this, to do that? <laughs> you know, it's, it's, it's a friendly competition, but we all know it means a little bit more than that. You know, he really wanted to get me. So uh, it's even right now, but I already posted in all Kyrgyzstan's comments, and I'm waiting on match three. All right, awesome. <laughs> Thanks, Kamal. Yep.